All right, Shelby, thank you. An elementary school in South L.A. was burglarized, vandalized over the weekend. The LAPD says nearly two dozen classrooms were affected. KTLA's Jacqueline Sarkeesian is live outside Wadsworth Elementary School with more. Hi, Jacqueline. Hi, good afternoon to both of you. 24 classrooms were damaged, and you guys, this was not the first time it's happened at this elementary school. The superintendent says they typically don't share when bad things happen at their schools, but he felt it was necessary to advertise and get the word out, share with the community what's taking place, because he's hoping that someone watches this and they know something that happened and are able to report it. Over the weekend, Wadsworth Avenue Elementary School in South LA was burglarized, and it's hardly the first time. This is a poor school and it breaks my heart and quite frankly, it infuriates me. 24 classrooms were broken into and vandalized. As you see from this video, chairs were knocked over, school supplies dumped and devices used by students were damaged and stolen. <laughs> LAUSD Superintendent Alberto Cavallo says it's the sixth time the school's been hit since July. For this is not unique. This semester alone, we've had 171 incidents of vandalism, burglary, defacing of schools, the stealing of catalytic converters from buses, the stealing of copper, the damaging of air conditioning units. Carvalho says beyond the cost it takes to repair and replace the items, it's a major inconvenience. It's more just destruction and it's disruptive for our students and our teachers and staff. So, so when we spoke to a parent who lives nearby and has a daughter in the first grade at Wadsworth. She says she received a phone call from the school notifying her what happened. To me, it's disappointing because I wake up every day in the morning to bring my kids to school. Mm -hmm. And it's really terrible that some people are doing this. And the superintendent says they will be deploying extra police officers to survey this area. The school does have an alarm and they're in the process of installing cameras. Cost of damage around $115,000. But once again, if you know something related to this most recent incident, you are asked to contact school district police or LAPD. Reporting live from South LA, Jacqueline Tarkesian, KTLA 5 News.